Hi guys, I wanted to introduce you to the new Tama pedals um, Dynasing. These are the first direct drive pedals that Tama does. Um, and uh, especially I want to talk about a couple of settings and uh, a couple of innovations that Tama did on these pedals compared to the old Iron Cobra or Speed Cobra, which in my opinion is great. So first of all, of course, is a direct drive and not a chain pedal, so that makes a lot of difference usually but on these pedals this is the first time that I have actually have the feeling of a chain pedal and when I do like the more groovy and slow stuff and the feeling of a direct drive whenever I speed up without even changing the settings and now I will explain why the first thing that I want to talk about is uh, these two settings uh, that they add compared to the old iron cover and speed cover which in my opinion make all the different uh, compared from whatever I was feeling before. So before on other pedal, any other pedals, I had to um, change and work with the spring to feel a certain way the respond of the pedal. So a loose spring for a slower pedal and a tight spring for a faster pedal. Instead now I can actually just by working with these two settings and without changing the spring setting, I can change completely the balance of the pedal. And by that I mean having the pedal that it feels going more towards the front, so towards the pad or the kick or whatever we're playing on, or more backwards, so more towards the foot. The way I uh, set the pedal was this. I got rid of the spring of the pedal completely and I left the pedal free to go wherever it, it would feel to go. Having this setting, so with the pedal board all the way up the, the and, and this part halfway the pedal will go more towards the bass drum okay if I put it around 45 degrees it automatically goes more towards the the pad in this case we just by just by um, modifying this part and having the pedal board all the way down instead okay so I will lower this part and I'll save the setting and I'll put this pe the pedal again at around 45 degrees this is what happens okay it goes all the way more towards the back the feeling of course is gonna be having the pedal coming more towards the back so just by adjusting these two factors if I put the spring back on I will have two completely different feelings this is going to be more of a, for me, a heel down feeling or anyway something that goes more in the bass drum so if you like to you know have more, play more in the bass drum you can have this setting and then instead if you want to have a faster or another type of feeling like the opposite feeling you can just put the pedal board back up and then that's it. So the other part helps, okay, it's gonna help uh, even more this kind of feeling. So um, what's great about this is that all this feeling and all these settings, we're, we're doing all this without touching the spring. And that's game changing, okay? This means that basically this pedal would work for any kind of drum. And there are at least six type of six different type of setting that you can do uh, using the measures that you have on the pedal to have six different type of filling plus then you can have the speed of the pedal controlled by the, the spring tension and in this way exactly I found like a halfway through to have a feeling of a chain pedal so going more towards in the bass drum when I play slower stuff and groovy stuff but then when I speed up, having the, the uh, feeling of um, a, a direct drive pedal. Okay, so that's why you have both feelings. That's what the balance of the pedal is and, and what's the difference that it makes. So I really suggest to um, have some time and, and go and try these different settings. Taking the spring off, which also this is a, a, every Iron Cobra uh, every Tama pedal have these options of just getting rid of the spring like that 
without having to um, lose any any other part of the pedal and and just try different setting then put the spring back up and then feel you know have the feeling you can feel it even without the spring and see how it naturally how the, the pedal naturally responds because this is what it really is when you get rid of the spring this is how the pedal naturally re responds to whatever you're doing and you will feel immediately like the pedal going towards your foot or uh, in the bass drum and I think this is awesome I've always played Tama pedals I like them I love them and I think this they reinvented the the pedal feeling with this pedal so I'm very happy of uh, using these pedals and I, I really suggest everybody to go and at least try them and, and I'm pretty sure you will find your setting and you will fall in love with these pedals.